We are in the MAN Trucks production plant located in Nipoomitsa. The facility was constructed in 2007 as the one of the most modern trucks production plants and we can still call ourselves a leader in terms of our scope of production and our lean optimizations throughout the whole automotive branch. Currently, our crew consists of 450 people, and the products being made on our assembly lines are two, three, and four chassis vehicles, which are delivered to markets all over the world. The first and main aim of the project was to reduce the noise generated by the internal logistics in the production plant premises. The starting point was not a situation where we had not met the standards, because all the related standards have been fulfilled according to the laws and the proper regulations. However, we have found that in our production process, there was too much noise generated by the logistics and we decided to take action to reduce it. Our initial state, based on the result of a work environment measurement, suggested that the noise generated by our intralogistics trains was on the level of 78 to 79 decibels, and during the driving through the dilatation, the peaks were much higher. When using our previous system, we heard comments from our production colleagues about the noise level. They used to say, attention, here comes the cargo train. Our aim was to lower the noise level to under 75 decibels, which would be under the threshold that affects the human body. This aim has been more than achieved with quite a reserve, as currently our new system is generating noise levels of only 73 to 74 decibels. The difference between the E-Liner and the old solution is just enormous. It is much quieter, and even the employees themselves appreciate the difference when the intro logistics train is passing by. In fact, it is so quiet now, we could say we don't even hear that the train is being driven. Everyone is very pleased. The second aim, requiring the exchanging of this equipment, referred to the ergonomics of our work. A positive surprise was the fact that we were able to eliminate a stage of the previous solution. A locking barrier implementing a lever with a position lock, which in turn significantly improved the work ergonomics for our employees. From the viewpoint of ergonomics, we can rely on the results of an evaluation carried out in our production plant using a method of key indicators. The previous solution had a score of 22 points, which translates into an outcome of medium strain. For the new system, this load was reduced by 10 points, reaching from the level of 11 points which indicates a low level of strain. What does this come from? The employee performs two fewer bending movements during the docking and undocking of the trolley, which, from the perspective of a single shift and 100 containers, gives a total reduction of 200 movements per day, which is a significant increase in terms of work ergonomics. The transport set that we can see over there most of the time consists of four platforms, which follow the direction led by the towing tractor. Turning is very important, as often the driver of the towing tractor is unable to see the end of the train, so the need to predict the movement path of the train can be, I would say, essential while using the E-Liner transport, there is no chance of corner cutting. As far as the safety of our system goes, 
During the design of new solutions, we take into account the history of any incidents connected with the transport sets we use. The trailers have been equipped with electrical limit switches that monitor the position of the containers. Therefore, we have eliminated the possibility of unintended undocking or of releasing the containers by cutting the power of the towing device. To be honest, from the time of implementation of the system, there has not been any kind of accident connected with releases or a failure in trolley docking. The project has been realized in two stages. The first stage was to create the prototype and to design a concept for the platform itself, which perfectly fitted the needs of our company and the kinds of containers we use. In our production plant, we use several hundred containers, which are transported on over a dozen transport frames. These frames first had to be modified. And together with a group of designers from Vamech, we created the concept and then we moved to its realization. The realization was long-term and lasted a whole year as we needed to successfully replace all the frames and trailers. As a result, today we are able to implement e-liners on almost all of the routes in our internal logistics system. The MNPS Award Contest, which is being organized in all MAN factories all over the world, is based on reporting optimization ideas. Ideas that have improved production and improvements to occupational safety and health. This year, we submitted our application with the e-liners in the workplace optimization category, focusing on the scope of our improvements in noise reduction and increased ergonomics. We managed to take first place in this competition, which is a big distinction, competing against all other MAN production plans.